Hello, Brian Lynch here. It's the uh, middle of September 2012, and in the uh, last couple of weeks I've been putting in a bunch of uh, tree orders at various mail order nurseries across the country. And I've got to say that if you're thinking about putting in an order uh, for delivery in the spring of 2013, uh, now is certainly the time to do so, uh, because nurseries often sell out of certain varieties. So this year, Indiana had a ridiculously early spring, followed by a couple frosts, followed by one of the worst droughts in the last hundred years. And despite all of that, the peaches in my yard uh, just did fantastic. Now, coupling that with the fact that peaches were selling for about $2.50 a pound at the local farmer's market, I got the idea that I should probably plant some peaches out at my orchard. Back on August 24th, I emailed Adams County Nursery an order that had 19 different varieties of peaches. A week or two went by, and I hadn't heard from them, so I decided to call them up to confirm the order. They weren't able to find the order, so I figured that my mail server must have eaten the email, and I just gave them the order over the phone. They told me that one of the varieties I wanted, a tango speech, had already sold out. As luck would have it, the very next day I received an invoice from them in the mail for my original order, and it had the tango speech on it. A few days later, I received an invoice in the mail for the second order, and it showed that not only had the tango speech sold out, but another variety had sold out as well. So now I have these two invoices that clearly show that in less than 10 days, uh, this nursery has sold out of two of the 19 varieties I ordered. And it's six and a half months before these things are even scheduled to be delivered. So the moral of this story is that uh, if you want a good selection of fruit trees, you really need to order months in advance.